Hey, Jeff Howard here. And I'll tell you, I've got a lot of people who have been asking, what is my foil setup? What do I like to ride uh, and my opinion on it? Um, this is the Crazy Fly. I've been working with Crazy Fly for years and I have worked on this deck. This is the new one. This is what they call the f Light. what we call the f Light 99. Uh, these will be in stock. They go quick. A lot of people want these really tiny, very lightweight setups. This is a full carbon. Uh, it's got the concave to it, really nice. You can ride it with straps or without straps. A lot of guys in our area love the freestyle without straps. Um, I go out and do a lot of sailing. Um, I enjoy it. I go out across the bay. And if you're curious about what's up here, this is my speaker. This is uh, where I get to listen to tunes while I'm out there cruising and riding. I'm telling you, we go out and do somewhere, anywhere usually between you know, 20 to 30 plus miles out in the bay, cruising along and having some tunes is really nice. Um, these are the Var uh, Vario Dekine straps. I like a simplicity type strap. Um, Crazy Fly has a pair as well on my other one. I enjoy it as well. They're just simple straps. They're not big and bulky, just a little bit. I just want something to guide me when I'm out there really cruising across with speed. Um, sometimes I'll take them off and just ride freestyle, but a lot of the times I will put them on and I'm out there just sailing along. I don't use a back strap. Um, if I do small little hop jumps, that's about all I like to do. That's the way I enjoy my setup. Um, it is a very narrow type stance on there, so once you ride, uh, that's I'm usually within this very small area, which is usually what happens. So that's the deck on there. Um, I want to show you, these are the PKS uh, foil pads that I designed. I really like these. It makes it so simple to remove and cover and protect yours. It has a little tool uh, toolbox in here, so I always keep all my tools up inside the zipper, which is really handy. And again, I take these off, Velcro them together, toss them into the van, and uh, I'm ready to go. Don't lose them in a real good protection. Um, on, the, on the foil, this is the Crazy Fly Master. I really enjoy it. It is a full carbon setup other than the fuselage, which is aluminum. Um, it's interchangeable. I can change out if I want to ride a little bit slower foil. This is about a medium aspect. People think it's pretty high. It's really not. It's got a fantastic range to it. I'm not a racer. I don't go out there at full speed. I try to go as fast as I can. I enjoy uh, a good speed. It's averaging somewhere around probably 15 to just over 20 miles an hour is what I like to ride at. Um, I, I like that because I can also kick onto some waves and still ride those waves and not just shoot out of them. Um, this is the five, what is this one? I'm trying to remember the 558 wing and it's interchangeable again. Sometimes I'll go up to a little bit bigger one if I want to slow down and really do some surf type moves. I like the long mast. A lot of people wonder um, why I use that. I enjoy it. I ride pretty high so it's still very maneuverable. It's just my personal opinion. You can change these wings out. You can go without little winglets on the tips, which will make it a little bit more play playful. But this is my setup. I really enjoy it. We're looking at about uh, everything board and all like this. Um, I'm just over 14 pounds. So it's really lightweight, simple to ride, so smooth. There is a difference in foils. I used to ride some other ones. These are amazing. When you get up to speed, they're not all jumpy and jittery. They just ride so smooth through the water and foiling. Anyway, this is my setup. Is it for everyone? Heck, I don't know. If you have any questions about getting into foiling, about learning how to foil, don't hesitate to give us a call. We run a program here at kiteboarding.com that really saves you a lot of money. We want to teach you, loan you out some gear and equipment until you learn. So when you step up to the main stuff, which I guarantee you, there's so many people out there and I say, you will learn on one foil and then when you ride a carbon, it, you will be stuck. These things are fantastic the way they ride and the low wind performance is phenomenal. It'll put you on the water wishing the winds were light. Anyway, that's Jeff Howard here at kiteboarding.com. Just want to show you uh, my foil setup and how I ride.